Big deal tonight, folks. How much is it worth, Cole Mooney? Vince, tonight's big deal is worth $5,101. Oh! All right. We're going to be following the yellow ribbon on this journey to Oz on our first deal. What have you got for me here, Sonia? We have got a gift for... Oh, a kiss and a gift for Dorothy from the Wizard of Oz. So who wants to deliver this gift? How about over there? The Wicked Witch will deliver it. Get over here. How you going there, Sue? Sue, hang on to that gift. You have to deliver that to Dorothy. That is unless, of course, you want to deal. You can trade your gift for Dorothy. Move down. Oh, why don't we follow a little bit of the yellow brick road first? You ready, Mr. Music? Uh, <laughs> Cut. Too slow. Too slow was the music. All right, we're here, Sue. You've got that. Now you can trade it for the small box here. Whatever you don't want, I am going to give to to you. Come on over here, the smart. Linda, the smarty box. <laughs> you don't have to deliver the package. What are you going to do, Sue? You want to trade for the small box? The box. No, I'll keep it. You're going to keep it? I'm going to keep it. She's going to keep it. That means, Linda, you get the small box. Now, let's deal. I'll give you $200 not to look in that small box. box. What are you going to do? You want the box? I'll give you $300 not to look in the box. What are you going to do? Do you want the box? All right, I'll keep my $300. What's in the small box, Julie? It is a TV, a color TV. Linda, now you can carry a television everywhere you go. This compact Philips LCD 7.5 centimeter color television is from Bingley and valued at $999. Whoa, a great price. Thanks for playing. Let's make a deal, Linda. We've made someone happy there, Sue. Here we go. Hang on, I need another player. Come with me, the toast man. Follow us. That music man. All right, who have we got over here? We've got Bob, the toast of the town. Bob, we're going to try and butter you up in a minute, mate. Step back here, Sue. Okay, we deal again. Do you want to continue delivering the package? Or do you want to trade it for another small box, this time by Sonia? Whatever you don't want, Bob, the toast man, gets. What are you going to do, sir? I'll keep it. I'll keep it. She's going to keep the package. All right, then. Bob, the box. I will give you $300 not to look in the box. Take the money. All right. Bob is keeping $300 cash. Here's what you passed up on, Bob. What's in there, Sonia? It is... CDs. Here's a range of 10 CDs, all new releases from Bette Midler to Phil Collins and The Cure. Thanks to Warner Music Australia. Valued at $300. They were worth $300. You got $300 cash. Well, thanks for playing. Let's make a deal. Give them a round. Okay. Sue. Sure. We're going to continue on that yellow ribbon road. I need another player who's going to come with me. How about you? Come with us. Here we go. Skip. Skip, skip, skip. Can't you skip? Skip. All right. That'll do. Come here. All these contestants that can't skip. Shouldn't be allowed on the show. <laughs> Sue, you're carrying the gift for Dorothy. Mm -hmm. We're down here to the final leg. Do you want to continue to give her that gift and hang on to it? Or do you want to trade it for the big box here? Whatever you don't want, Kev, the Roman's going to get. What are you going to do, sir? I'll satisfy, I'll keep the box. She's going to go all the way with the box. That means, Kev, you've got yourself the big box here. Hey, Kev, I'll give you $500 not to look in that box. What do you want to do? <laughs> The box? The box, yeah, the box. Kev, I'll give you $700 not to look in that box. The money. I'll take he the wants money. the money. I hope you don't stab yourself in the back there, Kevin. <laughs> you've kept the money. Here's what you've passed up. What was in the big box? It was... Take 
music everywhere you go with this fantastic portable keyboard. Easy to play with one touch rhythm and volume controls thanks to Kawaii worth $549. All right, then, you've got 700 cash. Thanks for playing. Let's make a deal. Kev, away he goes. Okay, sir. One more final deal before we reveal what's in the small box. Do you want to hang on to it one more time, or do you want to trade it for the video wall? What's she going to do? Your sister says the wall. All right, so you're giving back the small box. Yes. Okay, I'll hang on to that for a moment. Let's see what you got on the video wall. A zong! Oh, no, Sue. Let's have a look what you gave back inside the box. Let's open it up. It was a pair of shoes inside $1,200. So, you know what? You played so well, you travel so far, I'll give you $100 anyway. Give her a round of applause. We'll be back after this break with a winner, maybe. Pay attention. Thank you. Oh, man, a couple. I want a couple. A couple. You guys a couple? Come on up here. Let's make a deal. We have got... A range, an oven. Sharon, got one in the oven. Have you really? Yes, Pregnant? Have, yes. Oh, it's a girl. <laughs> <laughs> and we've got Craig, the chef. All right, really pregnant, are yes. you? Well, you're going to need a family car behind curtain one. <laughs> it's the Subaru Liberty GX5 Speed Sedan. Blending too high performance and outstanding durability and more standard features than most cars twice its price with luxury inclusions such as power windows, central door locking, cruise control and AM FM stereo cassette system with four speakers plus the three year 100,000 kilometre warranty from Subaru worth $23,490. All right. Very simple, Mr. Chef and Mrs. Stove. <laughs> to win that car, all you have to do is find the right key that opens its door. One, two, three, or four. Which key? <laughs> four? They say key number four opens the car. Agreed? <laughs> You're never going to get them happy anyway. All right, let's see how close we are. Let's see how close we are. You say key four, we'll put that just down here. Actually, why don't you hang on to that, Craig? Because that could be the key to your new car. Let's have a look how close we are. Key number three. Sharon, you want to try and open the car door with key number three? If you can find the hole. Come on, there it is. What happens? Nothing doing. All right, looking good. Looking good. Okay, time to get the folding stuff out. Check this. Hold out your hand there, Craig. One, two, three, four, five hundred dollars. <laughs> People just keep on counting up there. To call the deal off, cash in your hand. What do you want to do? We're going to keep going for the car. All right, then. Let's have a look at key number two. Sharon, see what that does. And nothing doing. All right, looking good. It's now down to a 50-50 chance. You got $500 in your hand. I'm also going to offer you this. Oh. <laughs> Keep up to date with the office work or home budgets with this brilliant Amstrad computer. Easy to operate, perfect for all the family from Amstrad Australia and worth $1,499. $1,500 worth of computer, $500 in your hand, that's two 
$1,000 worth of cash and prizes. Call the deal off. It's a 50-50 chance. What are they going to do, gang? They're going to take the computer and the money and call the deal off. Some of the crowd are booing because they're spoil sports. Well, they may have made the right decision. We don't know. It was a 50-50 chance. You say key number four, open the car door. Well, for your sake now, I hope it doesn't. Craig, open that door if you can. It doesn't work. They made the right decision. They got the cash and the computer. There was the winning key, key number one. Opens the door. Winners! We'll be back after this break. Winners! Well done, you did the right thing. Let's make a deal. Friday is seven. Andy Hose that run. Hi, welcome back to the show. I need four players for the next deal. Let's make a deal. Come on up here. Diane, the spaghetti strainer. Wow, can we show that on television? I hope we can. Let's make a deal. The nerd. Sean, a dag, I'm sorry. Are you a dag? Yeah. Coke bottle glasses, the real thing, too. All right, come over here. We need some more people. Let's make a deal. Come on over here. Come on over here. And uh, who else wants to make a deal? Let's make a deal. Come on out here. Can you see where you're going? All right, spread out, gang. We have got... What's your name over there, Mr. Bob, money tree? Uh, Bob. Bob, the money tree. We've got... Innovation. That's not your name. Madeline's your name. Yeah, what's, what's, what are you disguised as? Innovation Agro Sister. Innovation Agro. Can we have a look at your uh, real dial? There it is. Okay, gang, how would you like to win this? Check it out. It is a holiday. Travel in complete comfort by air-conditioned Pioneer Coach to sunny Queensland, where two lucky people will cruise around the Whitsunday Islands with Royal and Endeavour Cruisers, including all meals and top accommodation in a stateroom. Have a fantastic time catching up on your tan and cruising away. Thanks to Pioneer Coaches and Royal and Endeavour Cruisers, valued at $2,744. All right. Now, there is not one of those holidays. There are two of those Ooh. holidays. So two of you will take a holiday. Two of you will miss out on a holiday. Here's where the holidays are at. Under these hats. Two of the hats have a holiday. Two of the hats have a zonk. I'm going to count to three, and then I want you to jump behind the hat you want to pick. OK, you ready, guys? One, two, three. Find a hat. Behind the hat. Sorry. Okay. Oh, the dad gets the last pick. <laughs> I'm sorry about that, Sean. You didn't really get a choice. He was pushed aside there by <laughs> Diane and her two very forward friends there. All right. Okay, gang. Two of you have a zonk. You aware of this? I'm going to offer $300 to anyone who'll sell me their hat. Sean? No? no. Diane? No. Madeline? No. no. Bob? No. No, he's got it growing on him. He doesn't need any more. $400 to sell me a hat. $500 to sell me a hat. $500 cash to sell me a hat. Are you starting to weaken over there, Diane? Yes, $500 cash once, twice. No. All right. $500 cash plus this sure thing. Show them what it is. Watches. Good time and style with a pair of his and her watches featuring elegant gold plate bracelets and date settings from Classic. Valued at $1,000. $1,000 worth of watches and $500 cash. Who'll sell me their hat? Sold and sold. All right. Sean, that hat is now mine. Let's see what was under there anyway. Give us a look. It was a zonk. You did the right thing, my friend. 
Madeline, who el or Diane, who else wanted to sell out? You wanted to sell out? All right, then you got yourself a watch, two watches, and the cash. Let's have a look what's under your hat. A drip! <laughs> Doesn't matter, you got a great prize, watches and cash. Give her a round of applause, Madeline. <laughs> All right, gang. I'm not offering any more money. I'm not offering any more prizes. One of you's got a trip. One of you's got a zonk. What are you going to do, Bob? Keep the hat. You're going to keep the hat, Diane? <laughs> What's it going to be, Diane? <laughs> Think! Hat. The hat? You're going to take the money and the watches? All right, I'm going to stay there, Diane. We're going to do the reveal all together. Stay there. I'm going to... No, when I say so. <laughs> Listen! You've got yourself watches and cash, no matter what happens. So I hope you've got a zonk now. I hope you've got a trip, because you've gone with a hat. On three, lift them up. One, two, three. Yeah! They did the right thing. two or maybe even door number three is tonight's big deal how much is it worth Cole Mooney five thousand one hundred and one dollars Vince that's a hefty big deal Bob you want to trade your holiday for the big deal he says no Sharon and Craig won the computer in cash want to trade for the big deal no Sean watches in cash want to trade yes. for the big deal yes come on over here the dag Madeline, watches in cash, want to trade for the big deal? No. Diane, watches in cash, want to trade for the big deal? Yes. Come on over. All right. Okay then. Sean, the dag. First pick, which one? Door number one. Door number one. What are you going to do, Diane? Diane says door number two. Okay then, let's see what you're taking home behind door number two then, Diane. It is. Diane, you've got yourself a ladies' package. Beginning with a set of his and her matching robes. Perfect for relaxing nights at home and made from cuddly toweling thanks to Juliet lingerie and worth $175. And then clean up with this collection of quality cosmetics. Made from natural products, this complete collection of skincare and beauty essentials are from Nutramedics and worth $403. And then, Diane, you can run on time with this exquisitely designed ladies' delta watch. Crafted to the highest standards, this beautiful timepiece is from Hourglass Jewelers and worth $475. Diane, your deal is worth $1,053. Good on you, Diane. That's a great price. Thanks for playing. Thank Let's make a deal. Stay there. The Dag, Sean, went for door number one. Let's have a look first what's behind number three. It is... It's a hardware package. Beginning with this Benchmaster workbench with a sturdy design to keep your working area organized and ready for work. It's worth $500 from Benchmaster. And then save on heating and cooling bills when you ins insulate your home with these Bradford Gold Bats. Easily installed thanks to Bradford Insulation and worth $800. And really get the work done with a set of pin chrome tools. The 137-piece tool kit will provide you with everything you need to repair your whole home. From King Chrome, worth $972, bringing the total of the deal to $2,272. That's a cosy prize. No one got that. Hey, you know what, Sean? You big dag. You got that big deal, mate. Behind number one. Sean, our big deal tonight begins with beachwear for the whole family. Cover up in the latest designs and colours from Beach Fashions of Australia worth $150. And hit the water with this inflatable sports boat. Featuring an Evermood outboard motor, this four-person boat will provide you with lasting dependability and fun. Thanks to the inflatable boat warehouse in Zodiac Australia worth $4,951. The total package comes to $5,101.
What a dag. Don't put it in the bathtub, Sean. Congratulations. Thanks for playing. Let's make a deal. Hey, there'll be another big deal next time we play on Vince Sorrenti. Have I got a deal for you then? Bye bye. Good night. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. See the stars of tomorrow finding their way to showbiz through Channel 10's Star Search, the new generation with Mike Hammond, Friday night at 7.30. And next, the 10 Eyewitness News. This is a Fremantle International production in association with 10, the entertainment network. Cole Mooney speaking.